Hi guys, it's Kamil here again. Uh, again, I'd like to tell you about uh, successful um, video making at home. Well, I think the most important thing is to practice. You need to make as many videos as you can. Be willing to experiment. Make 20 videos, watch yourself and see what you can correct, what you can do better. Ask your friends and you will become natural, more and more natural. For example, I recently um, made a video for a friend and when he watched it, he was, um, I think he got depressed because he realized that he was making some funny faces, he was constantly uh, scratching himself all over the place, he was uh, you know, um, saying uh, things inconsistently, he was going like, uh, 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 and things so, like this. <laughs> well, of course, I um, consoled him a bit, I said, look, that was your first video, so don't worry. Yeah. So he's very actually grateful for, for taking part in that video now he realized uh, what his mistakes are and, and how he, he can improve and also that gave him some insights about how he behaves generally every day with, with other friends and with people so by all means you, you need to do it as well so experiment and the more videos you make the better you become and don't be afraid don't be afraid you know just just do it like I do just do it okay right another thing that you might want to do is actually edit your videos and add some effects uh, which I'm going to do right after shooting that video. Um, what I use is a very simple program, it's called uh, Windows Live Movie Maker. You can download it for free from uh, Microsoft's uh, website. It's also, I think it's built in into um, Windows XP. So if you've got Windows XP you can uh, use what you have there or you can download the new version or if you have Vista or uh, Windows 7, which is very good actually, I do recommend Windows 7, even over Windows uh, so you can download Windows Live Movie Maker, which is it's free, it's got great features, and it's very easy to use, uh, really, really good one. On Mac, unfortunately, I'm not a Mac person, so I cannot recommend you anything, but there are some other good pieces of software for Mac as well. Uh, right, another thing is, uh, observe yourself, so shoot videos and observe yourself. Not only observe yourself after watching the video, uh, sorry, during watching the video after shooting it, but also observe yourself when you speak. So for example, what I'm doing now, I'm making a video talking to you, but in the meantime I observe myself internally, how I feel, what gestures I do, you know, with my hands, uh, sometimes I look also at my face, so to say, um, and that gives me a lot of information about uh, what I do, how I feel internally. Am I stressed? Well, a little bit, and I know it because I observe myself, because I have some twitches here and there, and obviously you can see that in the video, right? Of course you can do. So you need to practice and practice and keep observing yourself, because the more you observe uh, the reality, so that means you and other people, and the closer you look at this, the more you realize what they really are. And once you are aware of those things, you can now, then, there is a uh, very uh, interesting point about observation, about observing yourself, your feelings. Uh, the moment you kind of see them, the, your feelings, for example, for what they really are, they disappear, which means they stop bothering you and you are in full control of those um, feelings. So if you've got some nervous reactions, when you observe them, you uh, come to acceptance, you come to like them actually, suddenly they become your friends instead of enemies. So you need to observe. And that actually, uh, you do the same thing in, in other areas in your life. So observe uh, your reactions to other people. So some, your boss, for example, gives you uh, <laughs> gives you a lot of uh, well, crap. really, he's not giving you crap. It's just you making crap of what, of, out of what he's giving you. So the more you observe it, the more control you have, and the more powerful you are. That's what I um, encourage you to do. Uh, well. I hope you will enjoy the, the videos and all those effects that I'm going to add in a moment and uh, I will uh, appreciate your feedback about uh, what I could do, what do you think, what are the silly things that I do with my face, with my hands that you think I could improve, maybe uh, you think that I move a little bit too, too far here or, or I bend forward or I don't know, do some silly moves, blink too much, sometimes I blink because of that um, a light source here. Yeah. Uh, which is a little bit blinding, that, that's why I'm thinking especially on this side. So thank you very much for watching and I hope to see you in the next video and on my blog, camisview.com. Thank you!